once again. Now, today's video, as you can tell by the title, da -da -da -da, it's going to be a really um, kind of a big Sephora haul. I went crazy last night because I did not get the chance to go and shop Black Friday. One, I had to work too. I just didn't want to deal with the whole pushing and shoving. So, yeah, so I had last night, I just had a really like late. Black Friday shopping that I just had for myself. So let's get started. Um, if I never told you that I'm so into like getting into like maybe nail decors and nail polishes, I actually have like a kind of like a nail polish going on, and so I just went, I went crazy with nail polishes. So the first two products is all about um, kind of like nail care and stuff. So the first one is the Sephora by OPI Nail Polish Remover. If not, I'm mistaken, it might be $12. But this is super good. I would recommend to have you guys try it out because one, if you have really thick layers of nail polishes or maybe even glitter, it takes off the glitter and the um, thick layers really easily. You don't have to like go and like scratch it off and like damage your nails more when you're um, removing nail polishes so this really works well the next product is like my next kind of um, must-have kind of product uh, this is the Sephora by OPI, um, by OPI also and it's the quick dry spray this if you are a very impatient person impatient person just like me when it comes to drying nails I think this is the best and I would recommend this for you to get it. These are the $12. You can also find this at Sephora. Um, this one acts really quickly. All you do is spray twice on top of your nails as soon as you finish painting them. Yeah, so you spray these on and you just wait for 10 seconds and bam, it's already dry. Like, seriously, this is the best thing ever that um, has ever been invented. Top coat and a base coat before you put on your nail polishes, um, and then after you put on your nail polishes. Uh, this one kind of has a thicker consistency than this one. This one is like a liquidy kind of thing. But I just got these. These are nine fifty. All of these Sephora by OPI you can find at Sephora. These are all nine fifty. No matter what color you get, it's glitter or not. So this is a base coat. And this is a top coat and that's really not fascinating. Now, as you all know, that it's all about the holidays and I'm super excited for the holidays. So I stick with colors within the holiday theme. So the first color I want to introduce is this really nice like burgundy with a little um, gold tint to it. I don't know if you can see but I'm actually wearing it right now. It's super cute. This one is called New Year's Red Solution. And you know, I did a um, nail polish haul way back last year and I said sometimes I buy the nail polish no matter what color it is. I usually sometimes buy it because of the name. I actually love the name but I was more into the color. So that's the first color. And the next red, this is like super cute. This is really um, definitely like, defining glitter if you can see I still didn't even open it yet but um, this reminds me of Dorothy's red shoes and this is so good for the holidays and this one is because I said so isn't that cute I just love the name but I actually again went for the color and the big huge glitters the next one my um, friend recommended me this. I'm not a fan of like really multicolored kind of nail polishes, but I after I tried this on, I was so obsessed with it. And it's this one. This one is also by Sephora OPI, and this one has really nice and cute colors like confetti. And this is super cute for the New Year's too. And you know what? This one is called Sparktacular, if you can see it. 
This is super cute for the New Year's and like for the holidays. So I actually have it on right now with a uh, New Year's resolution as, as my base. And then my top coat is my um, Sparktacular, if you can see. So yes, that's what I got for nails. Now let's move on to um, makeup. I used to use MAC foundation, but I don't like it anymore. I mean, it's just my um, opinion. It's because I've been working out lately. I used to be a huge fan. I'm still a huge fan when it comes to their eyeshadows, but liquid foundations, I switched over to Makeup Forever, but it's kind of too pricey for now, but I'll, I'll definitely get it back. And I really love the Makeup Forever HD foundation, so I just wanted to get something that's really inexpensive. And I got it from the Sephora line, and this one it is their Sephora um, Perfecting Cover Foundation. And these ones, I believe it's $18 at Sephora, and I'm a medium. See that, and then for foundation, I got I used this already and I'm wearing it and I I actually like it. And um, this one is also medium, and this is the mattifying foundation by Sephora collection, also. And then I actually got a lot of stuff from the Sephora collection. Um, this one is a red lipstick. Like a really bright red lipstick. This is called the Red, and it's a cream um, lipstick by the Sephora collection also. And I just got a matching um, Sephora lip gloss in red also. And this is a matte red, and this one is the Red Shiny by Sephora. Next, um, I love this product. I'm gonna continue buying it. Um, purchasing it. It's the Sephora Dual Eye Liquid Liner and I'll show you it's like this kind of top and it's very sturdy too and like the way you hold it you can get a really thin line or if you hold it in an angle you can get a thicker line. So that's what I like about this and the brush is very sturdy so I've been looking for that for quite a while. And last but not least, I used to use the MAC um, gel liner in black. I don't remember what it's called. <laughs> but this one is by Sephora and it's the black gel liner and this one is called Must Have. And these ones... I believe it's $12 or $14. I'm not too sure. But I haven't used it yet, but it's a really nice mat and it goes on easily. I tried the tester and it glides on smoothly, so I don't have a, I won't have a problem with it. So yes, that's complete that completes my Sephora haul. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this little mini haul and I'll see you in my next video. Okay? Bye!